Hi all, welcome back to Auto 17 Development Tutorials. In this video, let's discuss Python inheritance in Auto 17. Using Python inheritance, each model or record is able to perform standard crude actions. They are create, read, update, and delete. Let us check how they work, the working of Python inheritance. So, this is our custom module, Education for Managing the Students in a School. And here, uh, these are some fields, student ID, name, guardian, user, email, etc. So, here, I want to create uh, the student ID dynamically. So, for that, uh, I'm going to create sequence for this field, student ID. So, let's move to PyCharm. Here, this is our module, Education. And this is the Python file uh, created for defining the model student.student. .student. You can see the model is student.student. .student. So here this is uh, the field student reference that we are going to uh, create the sequence. Before that, uh, let's check or see the class that we are going to inherit. We all know the inheritance. Uh, it means that accessing the properties of other classes from the current class. So, uh, for the crude methods, uh, create, read, update and delete, these are already defined in order. Uh, let's see where is that. We can see that in order models.py file, uh, def create method is defined. Uh, inside the decorator model create multi. Let's check the decorator also. Uh, that is in the API file, it is uh, defined. Model create multi. That is decorate a method that takes a list of dictionaries and create multiple records. For creating multiple records, this method is uh, user. So for the def create method, we need to use the decorator model create multi. That is one of the new feature in order 17. So here in def create, uh, we can see that create vals list records, creating new records for the model. So this is our defined the create method already in order. And also from here, we can see the other methods update all records in self with the provided values and also update the records in self with values and last method unlink unlink uh, delete the records in self so uh, for the for this purpose uh, we can access this class or these functions from our file so i'm going to uh, create the sequence as we define the decorator, create multi, then of create, look through the vals list. Next, we want to check the condition. I assigned the default value of the uh, field as new. We need to check this condition. After that, we can assign the value. Next, I am going to create the next code of the sequence by using this data file. That is, I already loaded uh, one of the sequence. So here, I defined the next code. That is student student sequence having the model ir.sequence. This file is defined under the directory uh, data and this is defined in the manifest. So, according to this sequence, I'm going to generate the next sequence. So, here we can add. Then we can return and super the function. 
vices. Your function is completed. Here I am going to create new record. Student ID. Name. Uh, the next code is generated here. That is, the sequence is generated here. Here you can see uh, the old data and the generated um, value for the student reference field. So uh, this is uh, all about the Python inheritance in Auto 70. Thank you for watching the video.